talent search and development has been the starting point of nurturing abilities in any given sporting activity across the globe. The setup will see the players improve on their skills with key structures in place. As such, the Kenya Prisons men's netball team has defied all odds to be a force to reckon within East and Central Africa. The team which comprises of Wadas has an equipped residential camp at the Kenya Prisons College in Ruiru with a mission of discovering their untapped talent. Under the guidance of head coach Evelyn Cherono, the Wadas believe the less famous sport will create interest to the citizens. Wakati tuna kwa na trainees, tuna identify kutoka hapo, na tunaanza kuwa funza. So, wakati wanamaliza training, initial course yawe hapa ndani, wanakuwa mejua idea netball, <coughs> na tumeanza kuwa build wakwe na self-interest kwa netball. Uh, giving it a try, I, I remember maybe in like 2005, that is when it started. Men just came up, joined with the ladies, decided i think at that particular time that is when they had decided the, the outside world had also come in with men playing netball so we now also started developing a netball men's team here in kenya netball is uh, men netball that began the other day but countries like mostly east african countries like uh, tanzania zanzibar and uganda netball began long time ago it's only kenya which had not put on so much so much interest but now believe me netball is a uh, Netball men is the best in this country. So we are competing with the Zone 5, the East Africa, the Zanzibar, the Tanzania and the Ugandans. They have a very good team. But uh, fortunate enough, uh, Kenya, we adopted very quickly. What do you want to story? Netball is your mama, si poa. You have to do it, you have to do it, you have lakini sisi tumejipatia roho tumetaka kuonesha watu game inaweza hakuna kitu hizi fanyika hakuna kitu hizi happen wanadada wameingilia football wameingia karate wameingia boxing so hata sisi tumeamua round pia tuifanye kwa the other way wanaume wacheze game ya wamama na imetunisha poa imetupeleka mbali na kwa hivyo tunaomba pia ma sponsor watoke watu sponsor at least watupatie pia ile motivation ndo pia watu wengine waweze come ku join Diverting it to women is a bit difficult, but Kenya is coming up. Yeah, Kenya is coming up because even in all Afghan games, the netball men went. Uh, that is, uh, I think it was a curtain raising in Africa. So very soon I think we'll be in, in World Cup, in Commonwealth Games. Key structures are needed to be rolled out in schools, colleges, universities and other educational institutions towards galvanizing their talents. Most of the warders, including Edwin Tala and Caleb Amui, had the opportunity to bat their talent in netball as they did not have the interest at that time. And when we do our recruitment, we also tap talents when they are inside, when they have, we've recruited. We, all, we don't only depend on schools, we depend on even our own. Yeah, so several times we tap talents from in a recruitment which is done. I used to play basketball when I was outside, when I had not joined the service. So when we came here, we, we found basketball was there. But uh, unfortunately in Kenya prison, uh, basketball is not as such as a, a strong team or a, it doesn't have a strong team. Uh, so an opportunity arose and uh, uh, there is a coach which uh, we used to have he came, uh, she came and she told us we can start netball, men netball. Apart from the game, the warders have been delegated other duties during off-season that impresses rehabilitation programs and educational workshops for the inmates. During that time when they, they, they are, there, is, there is no much going out, they are deployed to various sections and also there is a time when a season, season in an end. They come from various stations. They, they are not stationed here. They come from various stations. We release them to go back to their stations. When the season, season begins, they now come back to start on with the training. When you come here for the training, you are given that skills. First of all, you have to remember that you are a warder. Then secondly, you, you put in the, the, the skills for sports. Mostly we usually have some, let's say, ball games, mostly. They include the ball games, they include football, netball, volleyball. But through sports, mostly us as warders, 
we usually enjoy to cheat the the prisoners this game so that even mostly they usually laugh because you know sports sports refresh the mind so mostly use that we use our talent not only for the Kenya prisons uh, department but also for the inmates and then after league when we close the leagues on November then we resume to our working places so there you got so we, 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 when you re resume we got some chance to interact with the inmates Kenya prisons has defied all the odds to come up with a men's netball team key structures being put in place at the grassroots level will see the boy child having the chance to play the netball game as it has been seen by the girls as the Kenya Netball Federation tries to roll out its program at the grassroots level, the netball game is going to be established across the country. Netball is, has not been there. That means if you can come, it's a new sport. And if it is a new sport, that means if the government brings more people, and it, it, it's going, we are going to gain a lot, because many countries had not realized. By the time people wake up that there is netball for men, Kenya will be very far. In liaison with the Kenya Netball Federation, more talents will have to be developed from the grassroots level. However, the Deputy Sports Officer Lucy Elunda confirmed that Kenya Prisons has rolled out a sports session that is one way of tapping inmates' talents that will at one point play netball. Mostly we identify talent during training because at that particular time that is when we've got people from various areas and uh, on Wednesdays we have, it's our sporting day on daily basis, that is on weekly basis. That is the time we identify talent, that is where we identify we have people who can be in this field and then we now start off and also beef those 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 sporting activities Zili Ambazo. Maybe they may run short of players who've been there for a long time. Um Chezo ya watoto wa shule unapata walimu awawezi waka wakaenda courses ya Ya, ya netbolli so wakati nafika kucheza tournament ya ball games unapata netbolli iko chini kwa sababu uh, walimu hawaendi hawapeleki kupata uh, new rules wangekuwa wanaenda kupata new rules wangekuwa wanaelezewa umuhimu ya netball ambapo wakitoka huko ku, kumaliza hiyo course wanakuja wana apply kwa kwa watoto wa shule unakuja unapata kwa secondary Sio mbaya vile, unapata at least secondary, kuna, kuna, kuna netboli eh, kwa upande ya ladies inafanya vizuri. Na upande ya men's team inakuwa still bado iko chini kwa sababu uh, unapata awana interest ya, ya netboli ya men, lakini unapata wanakuwa na interest ya netboli ya ladies. Ukikuja unapata upande ya colleges eh, kama ya walimu, Unapata netball men iko juu sana kuliko ladies. So unapata netball men kwa colleges eh, iko juu na teams iko mingi. Kwa sababu the, wan, wanaendanga selections, wakisha maliziwa selections, wanaenda wanawakilisha inji inje. The difference is basketball you have to dribble. But netball is about how accurate your passes are. Apart from athletics, Kenya could have been represented at this year's London Olympic Games. Ironically, the men's team failed to make its first appearance in the All-Africa Games hosted in Mozambique last year over disputed opponents. It caught us to, to a surprise when we were in Maputo, when we were being told that most of the teams, they have withdrawn. So we were, we were being told that all the teams have withdrawn, so we are only have only two teams. So we could not play. But later, the, 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 the Koja sit, so, sat down. And they decided, because this is the first time they're introducing all, netball in all African games, so they wanted to give us opportunity. But due to some hiccup here and there, we find ourselves that we are being told that there is no team and we are jetted back to the country. Tukiwa Kenya, tulipewa mazoezi ya kutosha, tukapelekwa residential kasarani, tukapewa kila kitu, lakini tulipo fika maputo, the first two days, tulika vizuri. The third day, tukambiwa men's team, awata participate kwa netball. So, tukajiuliza kwa nini, awawezi waka participate kwa netball. So, ule tulienda pamoja kama chief, uh, chief Dimshaw, akatuambia we have to go back. 
tukajaribu kuuliza why lakini tukaambiwa hakuna netball uh, men's team tuliporudishwa later on tulikuja tukapata habari ya kwamba kulikuwa na netball uh, team na maputo wakachukua trophy so up to today sisi bado tuko kwa dilemma atujaelezewa tulirudishwa kwa nini atujaelezewa sababu ilikuwa ni nini first thing you must love the game so you are being demoralized because you are being told you are going to to maputo and then there we are not given a chance to play and yet it was our first time and it was not yani most of the player we didn't want liked yeah so our hope was when we go to maputo we win and then we come back we prepare ourselves for olympics equal sponsorship is needed to facilitate the sport that has been neglected over the years nonetheless the kenya prisons men's netball team hopes to defend the east and central african netball challenge trophy that begins in uganda today the kenya team is expecting tough opposition from zanzibar's police team ukiwa umeshinda mara tatu inji zingine lazima saa hizi wanaweka bidii wakijua ya kwamba hatutaki Kenya Prisons eh, team ichukue kikombe tena but kulingana na vile nimekaa na timu yangu na ile mazoezi nimepewa na ile usaidizi pia nimesaidiwa na sports council yangu naona vijana wako in good shape na nita, natarajia kwamba tutaenda kuweka bidii na tutakuja tukiwa tuko sawa. Uh, upinzani mpaka itakuwa cuz sahi watu wana fight kutu beat sisi. But si tunajua tunakuja na kikombe hapa Kenya. Okay. Wale watatusumbua sana itakuwa Zanzibar polisi. Lakini tunajua tunajua weak, weak point zao na tumezi tumezifanya fanya hapa kiasi. So atuna, at this nothing to worry. Tutakuwa poa najua tutaleta kikombe mtarajie tu kikombe tunaleta hapa The Kenya men's prison team was denied the chance to play in the London Olympic Games this year after they missed the chance to play in the All Africa Games hosted in Maputo Mozambique last year However the team has shifted its focus to the East and Central Africa club competition to be hosted in Uganda while the government set up a committee to probe what happened in Maputo last year the players have the delight of playing in the Commonwealth Games Ah, uh, Mbaka Collins, GBS News.